Hey all Evil Eyes out there, my name is Evil Eye and um, I just wanted to do a little small video because I felt like I should. Um, so recently you guys have noticed that I've been playing Glitch in the System and hopefully soon to be the boss. And yes, those are JSC games and I know that he should be playing them, but I got recommended playing Glitch in the System by a lot of my friends on Twitter. But um, I wanted to go on and say that when playing these games, I could see just how much the JSE community has influenced a lot of these amazing creators and has influenced a lot of people to do such amazing games and art and things like that. And I wanted to say, this is very, very hard for me and I have no idea why, but I wanted to say, to my subscribers and to my Twitters, followers, and anybody in between, I want to thank you guys so much for getting not only me, but to other people, giving that that strength and energy to be who they are and to helping them find themselves. And God, this is so hard <laughs> because I'm. The reason I'm quite crying is because we had managed to get to 300 plus subs uh, this year and I'm so grateful to every single one because I never thought I would get here to this point and I want to thank you guys so much for the love and support that you've given to me and to yourselves as well. I mean... I know with last year, it was crazy with the whole pandemic and all everything that was going on, the fires, the everything that happened last year, at the start of the decade, you would think that everything was going to be great and then it wasn't. I mean, it started out really bad, but I mean, for me, I felt awful because of the fact that during that year, I had earned 180 plus subscribers within that year in such a fast time and I didn't even know how or why it happened but it did and to be honest I felt like I did not deserve a single one of them because of the fact that I didn't do what I was hoping to do which was put in more effort and more more time to the channel itself and I I felt devastated in my own emotional BS that I was letting things around me get in the way of things that I love doing, which is entertaining and putting an influence on everybody that I can, who's part of my channel, who's part of my community and a part of the JSE community. And I mean, everybody, I know you've seen the text messages, the tweets that my emotional state wasn't what it was just when I started this channel and and I felt horrible. I felt really horrible for it. And I wanna say sorry to you guys. You guys are all so amazing people and I, I can't thank you enough for everything that you do. There's just, it's always hard because there's never enough time in the day to, to do this kind of stuff. And I always try to make it so that way it happens. Because every single one of you, I cherish every single one of the subscribers I get. I cherish every person who I talk to and every person who has influenced my life. That includes like people like Jack Guy and Markiplier and PewDiePie and all these people who I've who I've been with since I was so young. Jack Guy being the biggest one because of the fact that he has influenced the most out of my channel. And I know people have told me, like, I have almost, like, the same energy and same bombasticness as he does, but, I mean, I don't deserve any of that saying. I don't deserve feeling like I should be be compared to somebody who's, ju who's done such amazing work for his own community. I don't feel like I've, I've deserved that at all, and I know that with a lot of you, you're going to tell me that, no, you do deserve it. You do deserve everything that you've built, everything that you've done, everything that you've strived for in your channel. 
And to be honest, I really feel like I haven't. I don't feel like I've even come close to making that that dent, that sacrifice, that drive to do what I can for the community and the channel. And I want to say this right now. Since we've hit 300 subscribers, I'm going to do my darnest to do what I can for this channel. The The boss game, the message at the end of it, it impacted me so hard and in such a positive way. It reminded me why I had started my channel in the first place. It reminded me what I did to be able to be here today and to have so many amazing people on this channel and on the community and everything. And I am so grateful for it. I'm so grateful that I was, that I remembered that. I'm so grateful that people have reminded me who I am, who I, who, who I am supposed to be for this channel. And I want to thank every single one of you for doing that. All of you are amazing people. And I know that even though I'm saying this, it may seem like I'm just saying it to say it. I'm not. I'm really not. I'm saying this out of the bottom of my heart because of the fact that it really has impacted me so much and in such a positive way. And I want to thank you guys so much again. Thank you guys so, so very much. Before this gets way too sappy, I think I might end it here. <laughs> But again, I just want you guys to know that I I care so much about this community. I hope we keep making it grow. I hope we can still keep supporting each other through thick and thin, through better or worse. I want to make sure that this community is built up in such a positive way. Not the, the, not the negative way that I had last year. Well, we didn't have any negativity, but you guys know what I meant. I don't want to be that negative person beating on myself kind of person. I want to be that person that builds myself up, who builds you guys up. I want to be that person who you guys can look up to. And I want to be that person who's there for each and every one of you whenever you need me. So thank you guys so much for watching this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay purely awesome.